We're here in Kansas City for this AFC matchup between the Bills and the Chiefs. The snow continues to fall as the special teams take the field. A winter wonderland is the site for this one today. Yeah, it's beautiful. I know the fans at home are going to love watching this on TV, but I'll tell you this, it will not affect today's game. These quarterbacks can throw in the snow. It's the wind that's the big problem. Chiefs getting set for kickoff. Lined up now as a slot receiver. First and ten. Heaving it down the field. And it falls incomplete. What a good job by the defensive back that time. That ball was thrown beautifully down the field. High arcing throw. But the defensive back in great position knocks it down. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. Looking to the right side and throwing. And a completion this time. Well, it doesn't look like much, but it really serves the purpose. Picks up the first down, and now they have a chance to open things up. Let's see how they back up the big play here. Looking long. And they can't connect. They call that the moment of truth. It's a beautiful throw down the field, but the defensive back, he waits until it's time to make that jump. He defends the pass. What a good job of the defensive back. Emmanuel's back in shotgun formation. Challenges the coverage and has the completion. Wow, when you keep picking up first downs like this, it gives you confidence. But maybe most importantly, it gets the defense sitting over there going, what's coming next? Goodwin's lined up in the slot. First and ten. Spillers handed the football. Running to the right. Tackles made. Well, I know it was a short run that time by the but the offense, but it's what it's going to do for you long term. Keep running that football. Try to wear the defense down. And now they'll try over again on second down. Throwing now to his left. Pass is made, and it's incomplete. The hit jars the ball out. After the incomplete pass, it's third down. Working that left side. The ball's deflected incomplete. This defense you're playing against, they're pretty good. So it's fourth down near midfield. Punt the football. A receiver in the slot. Challenging the defenders to the right side. The Bills get a first down. Well, you work all week long on a game plan if you're the offensive coordinator, and you come right out, and it works. Yeah, it gives you a lot of confidence, doesn't it? Makes the 
offensive players. They feel good about what's going on, and it gives confidence to that play caller. That's just as important. First and ten. A tackle behind the line. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. Offense lines up here. The give to the running back. To the right. They tackle him at the 26-yard line. When you're going against a really athletic defense, there's nothing like reverses and the counter run game because they see it, they go, and you counter it, and that's why it works to perfection. Third down and five. Set up screen. He makes the catch. The tackle was made short of the first, and that'll bring up fourth down. Looking for an open receiver on the right. This is going to set up a change of possession. Well, that's four plays and out for the offense, and that was bad. Bad play calling, bad play, bad execution. Go to the bench and try to rethink what you're doing. First down, offense readying for the snap. Running back gets it on the handoff. Well, the long run that time, and there's a lot of reasons why they got that long run. But the, the biggest one, the good blocking up front, but what patience for the running back. He did not panic because it took a while for that running lane to develop. When it did, he saw it, he hit it, and he used his talents to get down the field for the big game. First down here after the run. Charles is taking the handoff, and that'll be a gain of about two. The Bills with two extra defensive backs in the dime. And they'll run the football with Charles. They break through, tackle him behind the line. Well, Jim, they didn't pull the defense at all. Second down, you run the football, hoping to make it third and short. Then you lose yards. Third longs, they're hard to get in the NFL. The Bills sat at the line. Dime package. Throws to the right. Jenkins going to pull in the bullet pass. He's brought down. That's going to bring up fourth down. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. Two tight ends on the field here. The give, and that's good for only a yard or two. I think the coach took a little risk that time going forward on fourth and short. Fourth and short in the NFL has turned into one tough proposition, but a good job that time getting it. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Back to the ground now on first down, and that's a gain of nine. Well, that was a nice run that time off tackle. And listen, this is a bread and butter play in the NFL. It's about power running. Can your offensive tackle make the block to free up that running back so he has a chance to get in that secondary and make a nice run out of it? Play number six coming up on this drive. Second and one. They beat him the ball again. Going to be a tackle for a loss. That time I got to blame the running back. Uh, he made a bad read. His vision was terrible. He makes the wrong decision, and it cost his team yards lost. Coming to the line at the 18. 
the Chiefs still possess the football as we begin the second quarter. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Good job getting the first down by the offense. A look at the defensive players on the sideline cheering their teammates on. Keep us on the sideline a little longer. That's what they're hoping for. You knew this was going to happen. There's the red flag, and the coach disagrees with the call on the field. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Ball's out. Oh, they cough up the football, and the defense takes possession. you got to protect the football on the offensive side. When you don't protect it, the way these defensive players can run. You're going to get in trouble, and that time it results in a fumble. Ohio! Ohio! They come to the line of scrimmage, first down. He's looking to the right here on this throw. And almost picked off. Not a good job that time by the quarterback. When you see the cover two defense, you've got to know where to throw the football. He did not, and that's why the ball goes incomplete. Ohio! Ohio! C.J. Spiller is in the backfield. Secures it with two hands. When you see zone defenses, throw it into the open spaces. That's what the quarterback did that time. Good job by the receiver running in there and making the catch. After the long game, let's see what they do here. Trying to plow ahead. That leads us to second down. Looking to the right side and throwing. Knocked away, incomplete. Good anticipation that time by the defender. He gets to the receiver just as the football is arriving, and he makes a beautiful hit to knock the football loose. Ohio! Ohio! Spillers lined up directly behind the quarterback here. Looks to his left. That ball has been picked off. Bringing the play to an end. Linebackers nowadays are so talented. They can just do everything. Uh, they're strong enough to stop the run. But how about this interception? Good job. Good reading of the quarterback and a nice catch. First down on the way. Throws the pass. Under fire on that throw. Dime look for the defense on this play. Let's go. Second and ten. He'll fire it out to the left. Hauls it in for the first down. Touchdown, Kansas City Chiefs. You never know with the talent of these guys nowadays. Little short passes. You think they're harmless, and look what happens. They got so much talent all the way down the field for the score. The Chiefs now will tack on the extra point. The PAT sails wide here. The Bills are ready to return the kickoff. He's got a chance to return this one. They stop him from running it out to the 20. Mark him down at the 19. Ohio! Ohio! 
offense lines up here. First and ten. And he's thrown to the ground. Well, if your offensive line's not good enough just to stop the pass rush, then you got to help him out. How do you do that? Well, you keep the tight end in, let him be an extra blocker, and you tell your running backs to help out, too, blocking some of these defensive line. They'll go shotgun here, challenging the defenders to the right side. The defense has really done a good job here in this drive. So they got this offense in a third and long situation. Let's see if they can convert it. Spillers in the backfield, single back set. Launches it down the field. The pass falls incomplete, and they fail to pick up a first down on this series. They bring out Mormon for the punt. play right there. Charles is lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. First and ten. The quarterback will hand it off. They deck him in the backfield. When you make play calls like that, you're not going to win many football games. That was a terrible call here on first down. Alex Smith will take it right from the center. Play clock's running down. No separation at all. Incomplete. Nice job that time by the defensive player. He is all over the wide receiver in this man-to-man -man coverage, and there was just nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football. Jenkins is in the slot. Takes the snap. We're about midway, second quarter. Good, solid tackle. Short of the first. At, now we've got a fourth down situation. Shotgun look here for Alex Smith. The Chiefs now move the chains. Gains 14. It is hard to make a tackle from behind out there in open space with the speed of all these guys in the NFL, but a good job that time by the defense making that tackle. Two-minute warning. First down as they head to the line. Jamal Charles carries the football. 
five, maybe six out of that. Nothing too exciting here, just plowing ahead, getting closer to that goal line. Well, they're trying to find out if this defense has the courage and toughness to stand up to them. So far, they haven't. This defense, they better pick it up if they think they're going to stop this offense. Second down coming up. Staying on the ground. Touchdown. Chiefs. There is no lead in the NFL state. We all know that. We have seen tremendous comebacks. So when you get the opportunity, lay it on them, man. Keep scoring. Lining up now for the two. Dropping back three. So from two yards out, they get it across and secure two extra points. Ryan Suckup ready for the kickoff. And he'll start his return. Gets out past the 20 and brought down at the 24. Nickel formation for the defense here. First down and 10. Looking across the middle. What a hit, and the ball is dropped. That's interesting as you watch the receiver trying to make that catch. He knew the defender was close, so he didn't put all of his heart into it. The defender made a nice hit and knocks the football out to the ground. Second down after the incompletion. That catch, good for a first down. When you're a quarterback throwing against zone defenses, look for the open space. That's what he did that time. He found it, and the receiver ran in there and made the catch. First and 10. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Tipped away. Let's just tell it like it is, Jim Nance. His receiver's not a very tough guy because he gets hit. It should have been a complete pass, but he gets hit. He just throws that football on the ground, and the pass is incomplete. C.J. Spiller is in the backfield. Down the field, but it's incomplete. Well, they go for the bomb, but the defensive backfield was not fooled. Yeah, they were all over at that time, and they just, that was like shadow defense. Wherever the receiver was going, the defense was right next to him. Great job. They're down here. Offense trying to pick up the first. Throws to the right, reaches out and grabs it. This doesn't look good. We've got a player down and he's in pain. Well, that's going to hurt him tomorrow. There's no doubt about it. When you get hit like that, you're going to feel some of that pain tomorrow. But the good news is, I think he's going to be okay. And once he gets a little um, uh, situated there, I think he'll be back in the game. Graham's going to get set in the slot for this snap. The Bills get a first down. Well, it's always about risk and reward. It is a risk to go for it on fourth down. When you pick it up, you feel like a genius, don't you? Ohio! 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 That reception Ohio. gave them the first down. Eyeing that left side. The pass is Nobody's open, tries to force the pass, and look, what's it turn into an interception? Let's get the injury report from Danielle Bellini. Guys, I just spoke with a Bills official. The injury appears to be minor, so the trainers are just looking him over one last time, and then he'll get back on the field. Charles is lined up as the single back. First and ten. The defense gets a sack. Got to give the defense a lot of credit here. You want to stop the offense from scoring here with under two minutes to go in the first half. Good pressure on the quarterback, and they take him down behind the line of scrimmage.
Alex Smith will take it right from the center. The throw to the left. That's an interception. They've got him down there. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled. Being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. C.J. Spiller is in the backfield. He had no time to get set. Second down following that incompletion. He's looking to the right here on this throw. He had it, but the hit jars the ball loose. Good timing by the defensive player that time. He gets to the receiver just as the football is getting there and makes the hit, knocks that football loose. An extra tight end on the field for this one. He's looking to go down the field here. Touchdown. This game is tight. The fade route, it's a big part of every offense now in the NFL. We see it here. Look at the receiver. Pins the defender inside. Beautiful throw to the outside. Fade for a touchdown. Bills ready to boot this one down the field. He's got a chance to return this one. Ready for intermission. First, one more play. Looking to the right side and throwing. The Chiefs are going to use one of the two timeouts they have remaining. This is a route that's not running up in the NFL, the corner route. So many times, receivers just go across the field, they go short. But when you make these double moves like that, you get wide open. And what a throw by the quarterback. The line of scrimmage, the 48. Fasano's a tight end, but now shifted into the backfield. The defense gets the sack. We'll switch sides and take a break from the City of Fountains, Kansas City. Third quarter is coming up shortly. We're back here now in this one, where the Chiefs are leading by seven. They're setting up return. The tackle is made. Nickel formation here for the defense. The second half gets rolling now as he takes the snap. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to, and also it opens up so many other things for your offense. Offense lines up here. Second down and two. Jabal Charles on his way the 20. keep the momentum on your side you got a lead here in the second half nice play that time you pick up the first down let's see if you can take advantage of it. that long gain sets them up here on this play they'll stay on the ground on first down force it across for the touchdown that was just an awful job, wasn't it, by the defense? I mean, it's first to go. Well, you know it's going to be a run, or I think you should be playing run. The defense not ready. They get overpowered, and they give up the running touchdown. The Chiefs for the extra point. Add the extra point. The kick is good. 
Ryan Suckup ready for the kickoff. Great starting field position on that return. Lined up behind his quarterback as the single back. The wide receiver shifting around in motion. First and ten as they go ground here. Hammered after a two-yard gain. Good coaching on the defensive side. Everybody stays at home. They stay in their gap. And they hold that run to a short gain. Setting up in the pistol on this play. And an eight. The handoff. Running behind the tackle. They tackle him for a loss. Lined up in the pistol formation. The quarterback motions the wide receiver. Third and eight to the ground here. They bring him down, and the offense fails to pick up a first down on three plays. The Bills lined up in the pistol. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Change of possession coming up as they fail to pick up the first down on fourth down. Terrible game management that time by the coach. It's three downs, it's fourth down. What should you do? Well, I think you should punt it. He goes for it and puts his defense in a tough position. Offense lines up here. Now first and ten. And they'll give it to Jamal Charles. Out to the 23. Well, it's, you know you're just getting dominated physically when the offense just runs the football right up the middle. The middle linebacker and the defensive tackles just have to be better. We'll take it right from the center. Trying to beat the play clock. And they go back to the ground. Good job of the defensive line standing in there and fighting. And they hold the running back to a short game. Charles is lined up in a single back formation. Second and ten. And they'll run the football with Charles. They knock him down behind the line of scrimmage. How about the defensive line? Getting that penetration, getting off the football at the snap, and getting it done, getting in the backfield and making that tackle. Fasano's usually a tight end, but he's in the backfield this time. The play clock's running down. The Chiefs call timeout, and they'll have two remaining. Jamal Charles is in the backfield, and he's taken down. 
Nice job that time by the defense getting the sack. The blitz was well-timed, and when it's well-timed, the offense doesn't have time to react, and they get a good sack. Smith standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. And they'll turn it over on downs. The defense does a fantastic job holding strong. Lit backfield here. First and ten. Going across the middle. That pass play. Picks up a first down. I like this. Show some patience. Don't try to get it all one play. Pick up first downs and try to go down the field and score. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Manuel's back at it now. Dropping back once again. And he's going to be brought down. Well, we know one thing. If you're a defensive tackle, you got power, and it was on display that time. Wonderful job by the big fella busting through there and getting the sack on the QB. He's going deep. And that ball's nearly picked off, but he dropped it. Outstanding coverage on the deep throw, forcing the incompletion. That's why he's one of the best in the league. He's aggressive. He can take away short passes but also has the speed and the ability to get back there and knock down those deep ones, too. Stevie Johnson on the deep pass, and it's incomplete. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work, and they stop the offense that time. Bills in the pistol. Here comes the wide receiver in motion. Caught. He stacked up at that point. I uh, can't give all the credit to the offense here. They go for it on fourth down here in the second half. Even though they're losing, the defense should have known that that play was coming and they should have stopped it. That was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. Touchdown, and this game just got a whole lot more interesting. Something you always got to be alert for nowadays in the NFL, the fade route. The defense caught off guard just a little bit. Nice throw, nice touchdown. They're lining up here for the onside kick. The Chiefs call a timeout and now have only one remaining for the rest of the game. The kicking team now getting set here for what looks like an onside kick. That kick came right at him, and it looks like the receiving team has recovered. Arrowhead Stadium. We're outdoors, but it feels like we're in a dome. It's so loud in here, the building is shaking. Alex Smith will take it right from the center. Final quarter underway now with this snap. Got a hand on it, and it's incomplete. Too much pressure on the quarterback on that play, Phil. Oh, that defense, boy, oh boy, are they aggressive, and they can get after the quarterback. We saw it on that play. This is going to be a tough assignment for this offensive line today. Jenkins is lined up now as a slot receiver. Hey, good job that time by the safety. He watched the quarterback, got in position and knocked that football down. He's setting up here. He's been sacked five times today. Really been beat up. This is frustrating for a coach. You call a play, you get the receiver down the field on a corner route, and your quarterback cannot put it on the target. Yeah. 
Jenkins lined up in the slot. Alex Smith's going to take it from the shotgun. Ooh, they fail to pick up the first, and the ball will go back to the other side. Flex round! Flex round! Goodwin's a receiver in the slot. The wide receiver in motion. Trying to work that left side. 25 on that play. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion. Flex round! Flex round! First down here after the completion. Loads it up. It's going deep. Throws it in the end zone. Touchdown! Good job by the offense. They get in there. They tie this game up. Now we'll see if the defense can take advantage of that momentum and keep it on their side. Oh, it's a fake. He'll throw it over them. Got the touchdown. Got the two-point conversion. People love to go for two in this game, don't they? Well, they do. And you know what? Now I guess you and I just can't sit here and blast the coach for a bad decision. When you pick up the two points, you can't complain about what they're trying to do. There is a flag. The last thing you wanted to do here was kick it out of bounds. First down here. Get ready. Jamal Charles carries the football. Now the play is there to be made, but the offensive player doesn't get it done. Bad job on first down. Second down after going to the ground game, the first play. It's got some daylight. What a run by Charles. Well, when you're on the defensive side, if you read the offensive formation, where do they have the most numbers at? And that's usually where they're going to run the football. That time the offense goes to the strong side, gets outside, you should have an extra defender there waiting for him. Terrible job by the defense. Offense lining up here after picking up more than 30 on the previous play. First and 10. They feed it to him again. Picks up six. Anytime your team is down, you're inside the other team's red zone, you look for one of your star players, your quarterback, wide receiver, or running back. They need to make a big play here. Second and four after the running play. They better hurry to get the snap. Flip to the outside. Down to the 15. Outside runs take time. And when you run outside, you expect the safety to get up there with that extra time and make the tackle. Good job that time by the safety. This game is not over, but the quarterback knows that time is short, and his team must do something in a hurry. He's got the touchdown. Well, when your offense goes out there and scores a touchdown to put you ahead, it's got to give a big lift to the defense. They've got to get excited and go out there and hold that lead. The Chiefs with an extra point try on the way. Extra point is good. Chiefs getting set for kickoff.
he'll have a chance to take off. And he's out across the 20 and tackled at the 21. Rams in the slot. They motion the receiver around to the other side. Down the field. But it's incomplete. Well, for some reason, this quarterback likes to keep trying to go deep down the field against this cover, too. That's not the spot you want to go. You want to look underneath or right down the middle. Time is running out. The defense knows he's playing with the lead, but doing whatever it can to just try to run out the clock. Looking to go deep. And they can't connect. In the NFL, you got to throw the football deep down the field, but the quarterback just, he overthrows it. Flex round! Flex round! Graham's going to get set in the slot for this snap. Halfback sent in motion. Third and ten. Ball's picked off. That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback's eyes. They got in position and they made the interception. late in the game and the offense is in no hurry. Jamal Charles pushes aside one tackler. Big gainer there by Jamal Charles. Two minute warning. Jamal Charles is in the backfield. First and 10. On first down, it's back to the ground game. Nice job that time by the defense. They were ready for the run. Nowhere for the running back to go. And they stop him for a short game. Charles is lined up directly behind the quarterback here. again and he's brought to the ground the Bills signal for the timeout and that's the first one they've used Jamal Charles is in the backfield Third and three, another handoff. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Terrible call that time by the coach. The defense was expecting run. They were up there. They were aggressive, crowd the line of scrimmage, and you just, you just played right into their hands, and they got the tackle for the loss. Drives it through for the field goal. Now the defense is going to be excited. They come out there. The offense has great field position, but they stop them. But they give up three points, but still a victory for the defense. He's a dangerous returner, and he'll have a chance to show you right here. Just across the 20 and tackled at the 21. C.J. Spiller is in the backfield. Almost intercepted that time. Quarterback was under a lot of duress on that pass, and alas, it's incomplete. All right, listen, I know he was under duress, but you got to hit these type of throws in the NFL. 
you're not always going to get perfect protection. That's not a good job by the quarterback. Second down and 10. Going for the home run. Incomplete. I think the coach has got to call more of these plays. That's a good job of at least trying to get the big play, but they cannot get the completion on that long throw. Graham's lined up now as a slot receiver. Manuel's going to take the snap from the shotgun. He's looking long, but it's incomplete. It's nice to have a good arm and throw the football down the field like this. But that time, that was terrible. Just overthrew the open receiver. Ohio! Ohio! Black round! Black round! Black round! Black round! Just about a minute left. It would take a miracle to pull this one out. Gets away from the pressure. They fail to convert, and now a change of possession. Jamal Charles is in the backfield. First and 10, getting sacked. I don't know what the quarterback was looking at. He had to know the defense was blitzing that time. Doesn't make a quick enough decision, and the defense gets there and gets the sack. Second down coming up. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. In this league now, you've got to keep these wide receivers and quarterbacks guessing. You just can't come out there and play man-to-man -man every play and think that's going to work. you got to mix in some zones, some blitzes, and then occasionally go man-to-man -man coverage. It'll be third down. Looking for an open receiver on the right. That ball is picked off. That was a terrible throw by the quarterback. When you're off target like that, you deserve to throw an interception. Ohio! Ohio! C.J. Spiller is in the backfield. First and ten. Taking it right up the middle. And they bring him down at the 33-yard line. Excellent job of just picking up the first down. This offense is hot. Another first down, and they are Ohio, moving down the field. Ohio. First down here after the run. Running to the left side, and he's going to pitch it here. He's got a wide open alley. You know, the defense is sitting back there trying to protect. Well, you can't just be that passive. you got to have somebody to up there ready to stop the run. they got to do a better job on the defensive side. Here they come, back to the line after picking up over 20 yards on that last play. First and 10. Going for the deep ball. And he's almost intercepted. That's going to do it here in this one. Well, it's a big performance in front of a prime time.